She came back last night. I stood at the top of the basement stairs and watched as she tried to climb towards the light. Her legs were twisted together, like pretzels. She flailed her arms in the air. They hit the cement floor with a sickening crunch. Bones shattered. Her mouth, her mouth was hanging open, jaws dislocated and swinging off her head. A vile, squelching sound echoed from within. A death rattle and a wail mixed together. A thousand banshees screaming in agony and sorrow. I sobbed as soon as she started reaching out for me with the limp, gray hands. Her eyes focused on my face. We had only known each other for a few minutes, but she had seen my face. It was enough for her to stay anchored to this plane, to stay here with me. I couldn't take the cold in her eyes. The dead cold. I closed the door. I went to bed. I went to sleep still seeing her small corpse and hearing her screams still hurt. Why did she have to be stillborn?